Well, good evening and welcome to our final edition of Mike on the Mic for the 2016 football season. Lots of football action to talk about. Games played last night, a few yet tonight. We're going to go through the scores from last night, tell you the three area games we have on tap tonight, and we'll update you on all the playoff action here on Mike on the Mic. Again, I'm Mike Hughes. First off in games last night, Hawks defeated Decatur Community by a score of 46 to nothing. In a high scoring affair, Northern Valley over Thunder Ridge, 56 to 40. Quinter was open last night. Lincoln at Osborne, Osborne comes out on top, 78 to 16. It was Lakeside over Stockton, 66 to 20. Victoria defeated Solomon, 54 to six. It was Norton over TMP Marion, 49 20. Logan Palco defeated Bennington by a score of 70 to 40. It was Rollins County, 42, Hill City, six. St. Francis shut out Trigo, 54 to nothing. Lynn was shut out by Pike Valley. Pike Valley come out on top, 48 to nothing. It was St. John's, Beloit, Tipton, and Rock Hills, a real battle there. Close game, St. John's, Beloit, Tipton comes out on top, 34-32. It was Phillipsburg over Russell, 56-6. And Smith Center shut out El Saline, 39 to 39-0. That game called with six minutes, four seconds left on the game clock. There was an emergency southeast of town. The ambulance had to leave. Case of rules, you have to have an ambulance at the ball games and unfortunately we're not able to come up with one game officials got together with coaches and they <coughs> called the game smith center again 39 to nothing now three games on the tap for tonight this special friday night your next tech local one game will be plainville of lacrosse this will be a good one both are in the playoffs who's going to be champ who's going to be runner up we'll talk about that in a minute our other games hayes high is at Wamigo and great ben is taking on hosting Topeka West. Now let's look at the playoff pictures. First off in 5A, Great Bend is number two in the 5A West. If they win over Topeka West, they would play the winner of the Andover Goddard uh, winner of that ball game on Friday, November the 4th. In 4A1 District 8 action, McPherson clinched for the runner up spot, Abilene Hayes, who played tonight. The winner of the Abilene Hayes will be the runner-up, and they will play at Bueller on Friday. Bueller, the champion in District 7. In 3A District 14, Phillipsburg, the champion, Norton, the runner-up. Phillipsburg will host Riley County. They were the runners-up in District 13 on Tuesday night, and then Norton will be at Marysville in the other Tuesday night game. Marysville, the champion in District 13. TMP and Russell eliminated in that district. In 2A1, District 6, Smith Center, the champion. Republic County Sacred Heart playing tonight. See who is runner-up. El Saline is out. And Smith Center will host Mound Ridge. They're the runners-up in District 5. In 2A1, District 7, Plainville Lacrosse. We mentioned they're playing for who's going to be the champion, who's going to be the runner-up. Ellis and Oakley are out. Their season is over. Now, the winner of Plainville Lacrosse, will host Elkhart next Friday. They're the runners up in District 8, while the loser will play at Mead, Mead the champion of District 8, that game next Friday as well. In eight man one, District 4, Osborne is the champion. Runner up goes to Solomon. Uh, season is over for Logan Palco, Victoria, Bennington, and Lincoln. Clifton Clyde will be at Osborne on Tuesday night there in playoffs. Eight man one, District 8, St. Francis the champion. Rollins County, the runner-up. Hoxie, Hill City, Decatur Community, Trigo and Quinter are all out. They're done for the year. Eight-man two, District four, Pike Valley is your champion, a runner-up. Went to St. John's Boy, Tipton, Rock Hills, Lynn, Tescott, and Southern Cloud all eliminated. Pike Valley will host Wakefield. They're the runner-up in District three. They'll host them on Tuesday night. And eight man two, District five, Stockton the champion, and Lakeside the runner up. That was all decided last night, several teams in the running there. Northern Valley, Wilson, Thunder Ridge, and Silva Lucas all eliminated. Wallace County will travel to Stockton on Tuesday. Wallace County the runners up in District six, and Lakeside will be at Dighton. Dighton is the champions of District six, so Stockton will host on Tuesday night. And in six man action, Pawnee Heights defeated Golden Plains, 
42-38. Pawnee Heights defeated Natoma the week before, defeated Golden Plains, so Golden Plains and Natoma out in six-man action. So that sets up your playoffs as we get set for postseason play next week. Well, that's going to do it for the season for Mike on the Mic. We do want to thank our sponsor this season, Phillips County Health Systems. And now, watch this game. It's going to be a good one here on Next Tech Local 1. Curtis and Chris will be bringing you the game between Plainville and Lacrosse. Good night.